Hi, I'm Ryan Peck, and this is Ask a Developer. Today's question is from Chris, and he asks, how did the iOS 8 and Yosemite SDKs improve app performance? Apple has created some really significant opportunities for performance improvement with their latest offerings for developers. The XC test framework that Apple introduced last year with Xcode 5 now has support for performance testing. Performance tests let developers easily measure how long it takes to run certain pieces of code. During a performance test, the code is run repeatedly and the results are averaged to get an accurate representation of how fast that code is running. Once a baseline is established, any changes made to that code in the future can be put through the same testing procedure and compared to that baseline. This helps developers ensure that the performance of code doesn't degrade over time. If a change to the code causes a substantial performance hit, developers can dig in directly with the performance test to profile the code, quickly identify the cause, and correct it if possible. Performance tests also allow Apple's developer tools to make performance improvements automatically. Before code written by a developer is run, it has to be translated into something the computer can actually understand. This is done with a compiler that can make minor changes to the code to improve performance during the process. But this does not usually take into account which parts of the code are used most often. In Xcode 6, a new feature called Profile Guided Optimization lets optimization be done with consideration for the most active areas of the code. In the same way that you might place icons for your most frequently used apps where they're easy to reach, the compiler ensures that getting to frequently used code has the least performance impact possible. These new SDKs give developers a good way to measure and improve performance and the tools themselves are working to make improvements that were not available in the past. If you want more details on these changes, Apple has related WWDC session videos available with testing in Xcode 6 and what's new in LLVM. That's it for this Ask a Developer. Tweet your questions to hashtag AskADev or leave them in the comments.